Hello and welcome. You're watching Me on World is One. My name is Heem Kaur Saran. Here's a look at all the top stories that we're tracking for you at this hour. Team of experts from the Central Forensic Science Laboratory to conduct psychoanalysis test and a lead voice analysis test of the man accused of raping and killing 31-year-old doctor in Kolkata's RG Kar Hospital. Amid escalating outrage over trainee doctors' rape and murder, West Bengal Health Department revokes transfer order of 42 doctors. Kolkata Police invokes Section 163, limit public gatherings around the hospital for a week. As pan-India protests over trainee doctors' rape and murder continue escalating, central government directs all states to submit reports on law and order situation every two hours. U.S. bridging proposal designed to enable Gaza ceasefire deal does not provide for ongoing Israeli presence along the Gaza-Egypt border or for mechanism in central Gaza to prevent Hamas's return as demanded by Netanyahu. Protesters light fire at anti-government protests in Tel Aviv, warn of regional escalation if no agreement is reached in ceasefire talks. Demonstrators chant deal or escalation. Doha ceasefire talks mediated by the United States, Qatar and Egypt due to resume next week. International Atomic Energy Agency Director General Rafael Grossi says safety at Ukraine's Zaporizhia nuclear power plant is deteriorating following a drone strike that hit the road around the perimeter on Saturday. London Fire Brigade says fire at some house now under control and investigation into the cause will begin. Priceless artworks including paintings by Van Gogh and Monet unaffected by the blaze. Oil spill from Venezuela's El Palito refinery leads to significant contamination in the Caribbean Sea, affecting the national park. Social media platform X is shuttering Brazil operations immediately after country's top judge allegedly threatened to arrest the company's legal representative in secret for not complying with orders to shut down certain accounts as per the company. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.